how would you respond if somebody attacked you and your faith by saying that the Bible is nothing more than a projection of your own wishes and wants? And I really believe Southwest has helped them to know what they believe, why they believe it, and how to articulate it. And I just think that's invaluable. And our students need to be able to think critically about what they hear, and then they need to know how to use their research skills to find what they're not hearing to be able to find both sides of the story and then to be able to examine it uh, for the truth that's there and to be able to discern the truth that is missing. If I went to Ghana Southwest there's no way that I would have had I would have had the ability or the knowledge or the confidence to be able to talk to someone educatedly about my faith. What I learned at Southwest really um, has prepared me to now be on staff full-time with Campus Crusade for Christ in Boston. Having learned the truth at Southwest, I feel more prepared to explain the truth to students out there and help them see uh, their need for Christ. I stop and I say, wait, I want to see this through a Christian viewpoint an event in the world or whatever. And now as we see there are kids that are young adults and they do it instinctively, and that's just something that, that's a gift to you. You know, that's an awesome gift that you can give. Southwest did a great job of educating me on, uh, on overviews of the major religions in the world, and then also taught me to, to care uh, for the people of those cultures. Going to the Dominican Republic for our senior class trip um, was one of my first experiences with global missions. Um, it really gave me a passion for the rest of the world. During college, I also volunteered with the UN. So our team's project was to research and pretty much develop a clinic in Uganda because they didn't have one. And we ended up winning an award from the UN for it. I felt like my educational background, starting at Southwest, um, really taught me how to organize ideas correctly and to deliver information in a way that um, was effective and could actually make a difference. Southwest prepared us extremely well for college and at college our friend group used to joke about us being from smart school because um, we just were well prepared, we knew how to write papers, we knew a lot of history with Bible and theology and things like that. So they'd always say, go ask the smart school kids, they'll, <laughs> they'll know. Basketball is a big part of my life at the time and it's something that's very important to me and still is to this day. And I mean it was, Southwest didn't have a gym at the time, not really had much of a basketball program to speak of, and it really wasn't competitive. And uh, I really wanted to play, and we felt that if I was going to be able to play basketball in college, that God would do it at Southwest. And uh, he really did, and it ended up playing Division One basketball. It was a leap of faith that my family and I had to take, but something that we would gladly do over again. I'm really glad that I did. Southwest had a lot of opportunities for me. Um, the small class sizes and the Christian education helped immensely in my growth as a leader and in my ability to be prepared for college as well. It's that discipleship model that really influenced my kids because the teachers are not only here to teach their academic subject, which they all really love, but they really love the kids and they pour themselves into their lives. They make themselves available. I mean. All my daughter is still being mentored by a teacher from Southwest, and she's married now. I enjoy the kids and want to see them grow up, and not just to be adults, but to be godly adults, to be godly men and women, um, and not just successful or competent individuals. We put six children through Southwest Christian. All of the kids, because of their Christian foundation, they not only serve uh, God, they not only follow after Him, but um, they are uh, rooted and grounded and involved in ministry wherever they are. So if you're thinking about giving, if you're thinking about putting your, school, your children in a school that may not be as popular as well known, those spiritual benefits, there is no price tag on that. My children today are being raised in the admonition of the Lord. They're being raised with the, with the foundations that were put in me. I can give back to them. I'm in the Southwest class of 2017 and I want to go to Southwest because it has a great Christian education. I'm a class of 2017 and I want to go to Southwest because I want to play some basketball. I'm the class of 2024 and I want to go to the schooler because I like it.